What happens when compute meets storage? Hello, my name is Elliot Yomkin, and I'll be covering computational storage in this video. Memory, CPU, and storage all, all have very defined purposes within the compute infrastructure. Computational storage is taking some of the processing capabilities of the CPU and doing them in the storage. Why? Well, as systems get more complex and there's large amount of data in systems, they need to run the application, containers, all the processing activity inside the storage, provide numerous you know, benefits, taking the workload off the host CPU, reducing data movement, and increasing system efficiency in terms of performance and power. Uh, SNIA, a computational storage, has a couple of uh, definitions for computational storage in terms of devices and services. The devices are actually the hardware product that are being delivered. The services include storage functions such as encryption, dedupe, compression, or non-storage functions such as video analytics, database acceleration, or even artificial intelligence and machine learning that, has been, that are being done inside the storage. The actual a, a product, we can see here four different examples of product that are in existence today and being deployed in the market as computational storage devices. The first one is an FPGA that is connected to a bridge that is connected to a bunch of SSDs all in one package. The second one is an FPGA that is connected to an SSD and that is all with one package. The third example is an FPGA with RAM, so there is no NAND, no storage, but it sits on the PCIe uh, uh, fabric and provide uh, enhancement for computation inside the storage. Uh, the last one is computational storage device that has an SOC that has the compute capabilities inside. So the common thing to all these four examples is they all do the processing in the storage and taking the workload off the host CPU and reducing data movement in the system. If you'd like to learn more about what SNIA is doing around computational storage, click on the link. Thank you.